I'm Bob Sutton. I'm an organizational psychologist. I've been at the Stanford Engineering School for more than 35 years, studied all sorts of elements of leading innovation. How I see myself is at that sort of uncomfortable intersection between the rigor of academia and what it takes to get things done in the real world. So in leading innovation, I'm bringing you ideas at the intersection between three things. First of all, the best research we could find about what leaders do to promote innovation, things like creating constructive conflict, psychological safety, getting people to come up with a wide range of ideas and then to pick the best. The second part is to give you some of the best case studies we can find from Apple, IDEO, Pixar, Intel, so you can learn from the best practices and avoid the worst. And then finally, we bring you veteran executives so you can learn from Perry Claibon, who invented the modern snowshoe, now sort of a master innovation teacher. Innovation is something that the uncertainty can drive fear. Carl Liebert was CEO of the largest residential real estate company. Change before you have to change. Once you get behind, it's really difficult to spend enough money to catch up. Sylvia Acevedo, her last job was CEO of the Girl Scouts. Before that, she was a rocket scientist, a tech executive. When people didn't look for somebody like me, I would focus on the skills and then that allowed me in. Finally, the remarkable and imaginative venture capitalist, Michael Deering. You have to tell a story. You have to be great at making sense of the complex reality for people. So in leading innovation, by bringing you through a tour of those three things, punctuated by all sorts of different exercises, is to help you understand the cases and companies you can learn from, the people I hope who can inspire you, and always we go back to what we think is the best evidence about what good leaders do and how they design their teams and their organizations. Mm -hmm.